What goes better with an intense snack than intense film? Eat this, watch this. Louis kick it. I think he'd be best known for uh, iconic ads from the early 90s. He was able to put advertising in culture. Howell Henry won Campaigns Agency of the Decade in the 90s. They were the pioneers, the challengers, the surprising. They were the agency everyone wanted to work at. And I think Steve was a creative that everyone wanted to work with and for. Tango, pot noodles, slaggable snacks, fourth emergency service. That Maxell ad is probably the perfect 30 seconds of television. Black currant tango, orange tango, apple tango, fucking all of the tangos are amazing. You've been tangoed was part of the vernacular. It was communication that broke the mold. If what he was doing then was showing us that there's, you know, a new way to, to communicate with people and a new way to shock and inspire people, I think what he's doing now is showing us there's a new way to create. When he came into school, he's the kind of talker that everyone gets their voice recorders out and their notebook because you just want to, it's pure gold and you want to take in everything he says. He just keeps going, you know, he's um, it just the energy keeps flowing. So that combination of a sharp intellect and great humour, he's always laughing or always telling gags. He cannot resist, you know, a gag. He's definitely a maverick. Very, very well-mannered. Poshest, smartest man I've ever met. Steve is a true genius. Rebellious, disruptive and creative. Fucking great creative. In three words, uh, reason we're here. He's a lot more dangerous than he looks. That's a perfect sense for Steve Henry. <laughs> <laughs>